Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel, The Black Widow here. I am coming back to the hobby. I am coming back to the hobby. I am so excited. Do bear with me because I haven't filmed in like two years so I'm a little bit nervous um, but I do have an unboxing today. No, I do not have any animals or any spiders of that kind in my house other than cats. Um, I do have a Mika. This is Mika Mika. Um, so I actually, yeah, I, I have kept nothing for the last two years. So this is all just as new to me um, as it will be to you guys seeing on this channel because I used to have loads. Um, I won't go into detail about why I left. You can ask me if you if you message me, etc. I might do a video on it later on down the line if it becomes something that people are just really interested in knowing. The, it, it's a pretty boring answer, but ultimately, if people would like to know, I'm more than happy to say. So yeah, do bear with me while I get my bearings in the uh, invert world again. I will be attending the show in Brighton next month, which I'm super excited about. But yeah, for now, let's just go and get these two spiders out and uh, show you what I got. So as you can probably tell, the first tarantula that we're going to unbox is going in here and um, I've put a live plant in here. This comes with a lid. This is one of the spider shops. Um, I think they're called like arboreal keepers and it basically just goes like that. Um, and we've got a little arboreal going in here, uh, which we're going to do right now. And it is a little carabena versicolor. And it says it's 5.7 centimetres. So that's quite a good size. Please excuse the dirt under my nails. I've just been putting this together. So it's obviously um, going to get under my nails. Right, let's have a look at this little one. And it's right at the top there. Probably don't need my tongs, but just in case. It's not particularly happy. It's a good little size. Oh, come on out then. I just don't want it to bolt, that's all. Can I see you? Can I see you? Oh, hi. Just down there. That's a nice little size, to be fair. So Carabana Versicolors are beautiful arboreal tarantulas. They start off as very pretty, cute, sort of baby blue colours. Um, and then they grow into beautiful sort of purples and pinks. You're going to bolt, aren't you? Please come on out, darling. Come on, that's it. Gentle strolls. Hi. Pretty, oh, so pretty. So as you can see, this one still has some blue coloration um, and it has a beautiful pattern on its abdomen, but they will change. These will go through quite a dramatic change into sort of purples. It won't be blue anymore. Sorry, darling, I don't want to frighten you. So let's see if I can get some cool little shots beautiful blue baby oh it's so pretty hi oh i'm so excited Not scared at all. Oh, let's not poo. And we pooped. Come on, little baby. Use my phone to nudge you. <laughs> We're on my camera. So we had a little escapee runaway, but it is all okay. He is back in here. It's a trusty little catch cup and let's now put the 
the lid on. Sorry, I'm doing a terrible job of filming. Let me just get this reset up. Okay, here it is in the enclosure, all set up, one down, one more to go. Okay, so we are going to be rehousing a Chromatopalma cyanopubescens, or however you want to pronounce that, which is basically a green bottle blue. It is a sub-adult female. And I've had a lot of criticism in the past for um, for not giving these guys um, or girls a hide. Um, and the simple reason for that is pretty simple, really, um, is because they will web a lot. That kind of does become their hiding place. So I don't and I've never had an issue keeping them this way before. I've also kept one semi arborally. I'm not even sure that's a word, but semi-arboreal before, and that also worked really, really well. Just seeing where the spider is. Spider is upside down. Just turn you around, darling. Right, I'm going to get a different angle, and then we can try and encourage her to come out. Okay, so we are all set up and now I'm going to try and encourage her to come out. I'll just check that that is all set up. I'm going to see if I can take this paper out. These guys can be quite quick when they want to. Are you going to come out on your own? Please don't bolt. Okay, there we go. Right, I'm going to put the lid on just a little so that I can encourage her to come out. Can we see her blue butt? Uh, not her blue butt, her blue legs and her orange butt. Yeah. No. So let's see if I can get her to come. Come on out. Come on. Go this way, darling. Go on, nice and gently. Here she comes. Come on. I know you're looking a bit twitchy, but come on, darling. That's it. Out she comes. Yeah, so these guys can be really fast. Um, but she has been in shipping. Here she is. So I'm hoping that that means she won't be too feisty or too fast. I'm just going to get you guys a better angle. Bear with me. Here she is looking stunning. She looks super healthy. Beautiful coloration on her, as I was expecting. I'm really excited to have a Chromatopalma cyanopubescence because I absolutely love the webbing that they do. It's probably one of my favourite things, and I think that she's going to utilise this enclosure and web it up beautifully. Look at her. See, see all this equipment. This is how much of a novice I have become. Look at this. Oh. I feel like I genuinely don't know what I'm doing and it's not to do with the tarantulas, like I'm totally cool with the spiders, um, but I feel like the filming on this is going to be like basic and I feel like my phone camera quality is not as good as it used to be either, but what can we do, what can we do? I've done the best that I can on limited funds and notice for the time being, but yeah. She's a beauty. I'm so, so happy to be back and I will keep you guys updated on what she does in this enclosure. Yeah. Oh, she's still pretty. So last little recap. This is where the Carabana Versicolor is being kept. Little blue darty thing that pooped everywhere, climbed everywhere and is probably not going to use any of this beautiful setup that I've created. I suspect it'll web at the top here and be super annoying and uh, in here we still have my 
Oh, what a beautiful spider. Shut up. You cannot tell me that that is not beauty and art, but in a living... F oh, just shut up. It is just beautiful. Um, But yeah, I suspect this one is going to create something beautiful out of this enclosure. And uh, I can't wait to see what it does. So yeah, that is everything all filmed. I hope you guys really enjoyed. Leave a comment down below. Let me know if you guys have missed me as much as I have missed you. Uh, give me a bit of encouragement because I am still, I am a little bit nervous doing this again. Um, I had lots of fun doing an unboxing. I'm super excited to be slowly coming back into the hobby. I cannot say this enough. It will be slowly. You will not see me with 100 tarantulas within the next four months, six months, eight months. This is going to take some time to build on. I have two children. I'm a super busy lady, so do bear with me. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys again next time.